Welcome back to Making Something Out of Nothing with Mama Reen. It is um, Thursday night and I'm about to make a little fast quesadilla. I already had some shit going. I mean, this is how you could be eating late night when you're hungry. When your baby mama won't feed you, this baby mama will. You know who this is for, but you could be eating like this too. Come get me. Come get your girl. I won't let her find out. Okay, so um, I sliced up some onions. I have some jalapeno slices and some cilantro. I just added a little bit of oil and I'm fucking toasting this shit, okay? I'm grilling. I'm just getting it nice and yummy. You know the onions and they do that thing and they taste like <laughs> that thing. And um, I'm going to put these here. And then I'm going to shred up some, some yummy ass pepper jack. And we're going to get to making this quesadilla. And I'm not going to shred the damn cheese because I don't feel like um, cleaning the damn thing shredded but look all I'm saying is let's we can make this work I'll give you the schedule you know when to come through and mommy feed you like this too and look let me tell you guys something if I don't respond the first time I, I seen the message okay I seen it I seen it and leave me alone. And look, you see all the flavored oil from this stuff earlier? Just leave it in there. I put a little bit more oil because when I do a quesadilla, how you could be eating your quesadilla, <laughs> if the price is right. This is not just going to be a regular ass quesadilla. So I'm going to go in with the one, two, and I'm going to flip it with the three, four. That's the key. And I'm going to cut this up right quick okay so it's been crisp enough so I'm gonna flip it one time I'm gonna turn this bitch up just a little bit now I'm gonna add my cheese if you, obviously if you shred it oh, damn if you shred it um the cheese will be a little I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about okay so now we're just gonna add in the little yummy ass filling so turn your two star quesadilla into a five star quesadilla you know what I mean okay so just place this shit around like so to your liking you know what we're gonna do now well eventually we're gonna flip this hoe in half and it's just like no it's not ready Okay, so I went ahead and flipped this thing in half, and now I'm going to uh, apply pressure like I should do to some of you men, but you're not ready. Actually, can y'all apply some pressure to me? Because I'm feeling like... Anyways, so um, let's get back to this one. So we're going to add some more. Put the filling. You guys catch my drift. And there you have... Well, I'm going to show you the end result, but there you have a not so boring and this is some yummy shit and it's so easy I stuff that thing in there and again put in the fillings move them holes around and maybe two and one too many chile so we're gonna take some out I'm not trying to blow a gasket you know what I mean okay so we have this side just flip it so, oh look at the crust look at the crust on yes Oh, Coral Reefs. Good job, Mark. And, um, yeah, so this is the crunch, the crust that we're looking for. If you, First of all, if you put your quesadilla in the microwave, just go ahead and leave. Go ahead and just head out because you don't deserve that type of, you don't deserve that type of treatment. Because there's only a few mama marines and, uh, let me tell you. Actually, none of you. <laughs> Well, maybe one. If you don't have um, cilantro, keep it out. And just grill the tomatoes and the jalapenos. I mean the onions and the jalapenos. If you don't have jalapenos and you have onion and 
Cilantro, just grill those. If you only have onion, just grill the onion. And if you only have cilantro, just sprinkle the cilantro on the cheese. Don't um, don't cook it before you put it on. Um, if you have bell peppers, would be bomb in there. Um, pepperoncinis is even good. Um, whatever other fillings, if you have garnet, throw that thing in there. If you have chicken, throw that thing in there. You can even put some um, um, sandwich meat, chorizo, bacon would be bomb. Like, there's so many options. Anything you have in the fridge, just check with Mama Rina. And I'm going to tell you if it's going to be good or not. Because chances are my fat ass is it has tried the concoction. Okay, you guys. So, here you have it. The yummy, cheesy, scrumptious. Kind of like a yum Mama ring. And a one, two, three. And the quesadilla is ready to be ate just like me.